Hello, my name is Rami Kimari and I'm heading the HSC business unit here in Teleste. Today I want to talk about this new release of the fiber to the building node E8. So, this is the new release of this compact fiber to the building node. And it has a all electrical controls and, and the user interface. You can align the device by uh, this push button, push button interface and, and with, with the display and all settings can be aligned with this interface. Optionally, with this uh, control module, there is possible to have a USB, USB Bluetooth dongle connecting here so you can use your Android application or, or so commander software to do every alignment. Controls are electrical and only, only uh, plugins are output splitter uh, module and a diplex filter, which is uh, compliant with all AC series amplifiers and nodes. One optional is the control module, which enables the remote access for the ingress switches and, and change the operation of the upstream laser. Uh, this module also has a possibility to, to simplify monitoring uh, capability and, and this module is sending the information about the node to head end and in the head end there is one dedicated uh, option receiver which collects the information what this, this module is sending about the platform itself. In this design uh, all optics are integrated to the motherboard, the receiver itself and option transmitters are, are integrated to the design. Uh, this node you can order uh, 18 different with 18 different wavelengths and, and so every CWD and wavelength is available for the upstream laser type. Uh, typically it is a two fiber solution so the transmitter and receiver have their own fibers but it is possible to order also with the one fiber solution so the uh, meaning that the WDM filter is integrated to the design itself and, and the up downstream and upstream uh, signals are using the same fiber. Uh, like E-platform, e the amplifier nodes includes plenty of the fancy software features and one of those is the power save operation which means that if the output level requirements is uh, decent, meaning that much much lower compared to what is the maximum capability with this device. You can put it uh, power save on to save the energy and, and, and some money of course at the same time and, and that is also the green value what Teles is offering. Other nice software feature what, what this uh, equipment is including is the laser operation which what you can select even remotely with, the, with this control module. So the laser can operate as a normal uh, HFC node. So the laser is constantly on. But also you can, you can select this uh, working as a RF OG mode which means that the upstream laser is uh, operating in burst mode. And there is third option is that remotely, even remotely, the laser can turn off totally.